Hello, ma'am. Uh, today we are going to present uh, uh, assignment one. Uh, sorry, we couldn't make it on time because uh, one of our teammates left MSU and then we were confused on how do we do the presentation and everything. So we just, and now we just decided on uh, continuing the presentation on our own. So, um, Today, me, Mohammed Saduddin, and uh, Joshua, uh, No Yu Chen, would uh, present today. So, Joshua? The information system used at yes. the operational management, uh, management and strategic level is management information system. It is a hardware and software based comp computer system that acts as a backbone of a com uh, company business. MIS collects and analyzes data from internet system and report it to help to assist the manager in making in decision making. So the goal of a uh, MIS is to assist people in decision making by delivering updated and reliable data in the scale of uh, finance, marketing, and manufacturing. So the main purpose of MIS is to connect different data sources. So the main purpose of MIS is to connect different data sources to devise one method to be used for future operations. So the main components that made up MIS system is the human resources, which is the people that uh, people relate uh, working as the <coughs> sorry sorry uh, redo redo psst, psst, psst. cut cut <laughs> so the main component that made up MIS system is the human resource which is the people involved in uh, collecting data the data resources which is the database used to collect and store the data the hu uh, software resources which includes all sets of information processing instruction and the hardware resource which, uh, which includes all the physical devices and material use in information processing and also the, la and the process so there are two types of data collected to assist the company which are the internal and external data internal data are collected from the information inside the company to assist the management of uh, management level of company and the operations so the two company that we chose as example is the Qatar Airway company and MIT so the first example of from the Qatar Airway company is the total revenue from the year of 2012 to 2021 Qatar Airways become the second largest airline in the Middle East in the year 2020 with a revenue of 51 billion Qatar uh, rival, royals. <coughs> so by the year 2020, the Qatar Airways Group fleet had grown uh, to 20, 207 aircraft. So the next example is the uh, Qatar Airways uh, income statement. So the purpose of this income statement is to provide assurance that the income statement is free of uh, free of data uh, free of error. The financial statement of this firm and the subsidiaries are included and, uh, in the for the year ending uh, twenty twenty one. As for the MIT, 
this is this data is a cumulative emission statistic. This data is used to attract the attention of students towards the university to show the, the acceptance rate of uh, students into MIT, which is uh, for the year for the class of 2020-2024. The acceptance rate were 7.3 percent, with only 1,457 were accepted. So the next example from the for the MIT is the scholarship given to the students which is in the year of 2019, 60% of the first year students receive financial help and so on. So this data is used to calculate the financial aid statement provided to the students. So next is the ex external data which will be explained by uh, Syed Udin. Okay, uh, so the first point, uh, the external data is gathered to help a company obtain a better understanding of their customer base and the competitive landscape. The second point, uh, passenger, uh, passengers' personal data such as ethnicity, national, uh, nationality, race, and others is an example of Qatar Airways external data. Third point is by evaluating passenger personal data. This information is used to determ determine the primary target for passengers in order to better understand and meet their needs. So the next one is uh, enrollment by ethnicity is one of the external uh, data collected from students at Massachusetts Institute of Technology. And it was established that white people have the biggest number of people, which is around 3,400, followed by Asian people, which is around 2,100. Uh, it aids firms in determining how, in determining how uh, customers interact with and respond to marketing campaigns, as well as making required changes. So the next one is um, give suggestions on how to improve the information system for to support more efficient business process. Uh, so the first uh, the first one is uh, data that are well organized. Any company that wants to be successful must have a strong organizational structure. If they invest in a good uh, information system, both businesses will be organized and will be able to make timely decisions and handle problems. Employees will have access to all information and as well, uh, and as a result, will able to increase their productivity the next one is keeping any type of disaster at bay so in the past um, businesses were unable to ac access the stock market uh, the stock market and their level of organization organizations can use an information system to study stocks and compare their performance in the past to predict any type of disaster. The MIS can maintain track of all margins and earnings so that businesses have all of the information they need to prepare for and respond to a crisis. The next one is information storage. So information systems are beneficial because they allow you to save data for future use. Same goes for Qatar Airlines. Needs to, 
Well, for example, it needs to deal with a lot of data. They, they prepared um, a flight plan. They have seat reservations as well as all of the passengers' personal information, which varies depending on country of travel. So the next one is uh, decision making decisions is simple. So without a good information system, the decision making process wastes a lot of time and energy. The decisions and uh, strat uh, strategic plans made by the organization's management affect its level of success. When it comes to completing business, uh, business actions, the company's management can use information systems to establish strategic plans and make the best decisions feasible. The next one is gaining a better understanding of the company's future prospects. As a corporate manager, using efficient MIS, all organizations must have perspectives. The, MI, uh, the MIS can look at a structure of your firm and come up with more effective methods for assessing independent processes. So the next one is conclusion. Information technology have had a tremendous impact on how firms plan uh, or op operate and support their operations. Information systems are related to organization organizational activities in a variety of ways. Organizations may empower their people and use their processes to obtain a competitive advantage by using business process management. Companies can benefit from business pro process re-engineering by increasing their effic uh, efficiency and improving the quality of their products and services. Information systems can help a company gain a long-term competitive advantage by integrating technology with business activities. Uh, that's all for me, and this also concludes our presentation. Thank you, ma'am. Yes, uh, thank you, madam.